Hey everybody, I'm Mike Sokol from RV Electricity, and I'm just gonna show you a little fun experiment I'm getting ready to do this week for one of my training classes, and I will share it with all of you on my RV Electricity newsletter this coming Sunday. So stay tuned for that, but let me show you the basics of what's going on here. I have a 12 volt power supply capable of doing 30 some amperes, I believe a little two amp fuse and a holder, a, um, a 12 volt DC incandescent side light bulb, an inline knife switch that I can open and close, another one across here, and another light over here. So what can I do with these things? Well, let me show you my ideas anyway. I'm going to reproduce this little experiment, this tutorial that I did last week uh, where we went through the bits and pieces of how to troubleshoot a dead short in a wire. What I'm going to use is a separate blown fuse that I'm going to put in parallel with a 12 volt incandescent bulb to give me a controllable short circuit. Here's my normal light on and off switch would turn this light on and off. And then I'm also going to put a dead short circuit over here. So what I can do then is have this open, close this, turn on the light, show what happens when we short circuit it. That will blow the fuse. And at that point, this light will come on and show us where the current will produce a certain amount of controllable current through it. Then I will use a uh, standard clamp meter can be almost any DC capable of one to show you where the current goes, where the current has stopped going, and then we can kind of predict where the short circuit might be in the whole circuit. What do you think, huh? So stay tuned next Sunday on my RV Electricity newsletter. Plus, once this video is done, I'll go ahead and publish this in a variety of my other formats. I'm Mike Sokol from RV Electricity, and see you soon.